Welcome back. For the first time ever, the Para Triathlon is at the Paralympic Games, and a Wauwatosa woman who overcame cancer could be the person to beat. Our Elise Menneker has this incredible story. Haley Danisevich is gunning for gold this summer in Rio, but just five years ago, Haley's Olympic dreams weren't dreams at all. There's some kids that grow up like dreaming of being Olympians, and like that that wasn't really me. In 2003, Haley was diagnosed with bone cancer in her left leg. She'd undergo a year of chemotherapy and several reconstructive surgeries. In 2004, she was declared cancer free. But then for the next year or so, I, I just wasn't really able to recover from the surgeries. So when I was 14, I made the decision to have my leg amputated above the knee. I remember going into that surgery and being very scared, but I also knew that this decision was going to lead to something better. It was that knowledge that really made me at peace with everything. A 750 meter swim, 13 mile bike, and 5K run. I will never be out suffered. I know how to suffer harder than anybody. In Rio, the Wauwatosa native will suffer and shine as she returns to the same course she won on last year to qualify for the games. That moment you qualified for the Olympics, uh, what was that like? <laughs> Gosh, that was... <sighs> That was unbelievable. And when I crossed that finish line, I, I really just tried to take it all in and say, okay, this is what this feels like. This is what this moment looks like. Um, and that moment is one that I've replayed in my head so many times. Haley says that at 25 years old for an endurance sport, she's young. She still has about a decade left in her of high level competition. So that means as a pioneer in the paratriathlon world, this is just the beginning of getting to know Haley Danisevich. In Wauwatosa, Lise Meneker, today's TMJ4. Thanks, Elise. And